Don't okay. make it up. Don't make it up. What? Next he question. What? what? He picked someone over me. And I'm never gonna You're be beautiful. Good. You're beautiful. I'm never gonna be good enough, and I'd rather God take me today You're than beautiful. any other day. We could have been a good couple. We could have had something special. But you one crazy ass bitch. This man just chose somebody else other than you. And you're gonna feel like this? That's not his problem. That is definitely your problem. You got shit to work out within you. You've been, you been through some shit. I could tell. That's a huge insecurity right there. She probably got abandonment issues. Imagine if we acted like that every time we got rejected. Oh my gosh, she went with him other than me. Why? I'm gonna kill myself, man. Shit! The way she acting right now is stupid. It's foolish. She got work on herself. She probably needs to take a break from guys. Cause ain't nobody wanna be around her. Yeah, she told me that she loved me while I'm in nine inches deep. Yeah, I know that love ain't real. You fucking with niggas on IG. Yeah, these hoes only love me for what you got. They see you as a shopping spree. What is good, y'all? So we got a video of more girls getting rejected, bruh. You know how girls be acting when they get rejected because they're not used to it. But us guys, we used to that shit, man. I was like, oh. It still hurts sometimes. But we get right back up because we know it's not the end of the world because we've experienced it so many times. You know what I'm saying? Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boy. My guy, my guy was slick with that. You wanna see what slick with that curve? Huh, potato chips, bitch. You gonna try to kiss me looking like that? Hell no! Hell to the no. Hi everyone, that's me from the video. Um me and the guy are dating. We just started going out recently. Stop the cap. You could have fooled me. You dating him. He not dating you. You know what I'm saying? That's what it looks like. That man is not dating your ass, man. He would not have embarrassed you like that. Okay, that man embarrassed you on live TV. That shit crazy. That shit is tough, man. You might as well go ahead and take this. <laughs> this L right here. You know what I'm saying? Hey, sorry. Your eyes are really pretty. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, do you want to maybe have uh, I have a girlfriend. Oh, you didn't Sorry. seem too sure about that answer. I do. <laughs> yeah, honestly, if a girl comes to me like that, I think she's a hooker. I think she got AIDS or some shit, and she trying to set me up, and I will get the fuck out of there. These girls really don't know how to butter you up before they start asking oblivious ass questions. Landon. What up? Would you f right now? What? <laughs> would you f me right now? How hammered are you? <laughs> It's a yes or no question. Just say yes or no. I'm being so serious right now. Like, you have to. Oh, why are you asking me this? Literally, like, just say yes or no, Landon. It's not that deep. It's really not. You're being dead right now. Okay. That. Dang, he ruined his chance. He really did. This man is so deep and so used to the friend zone that you asking him a question like that is like, it's like breaking the matrix. Like, that shit should not be happening. You know what I'm saying? So he definitely gonna think it's a joke. That man probably knew he was being recorded because he knows she will never say no shit like that. She, and then she felt hella salty after that because she couldn't expose my guy on camera. Yeah. Take that L, my baby. Take that L. All right, uh, all right Paige. So you just want to turn on the camera? That one there was a violation. Hey, I would have did the same shit too. I ain't gonna lie, man. I've been like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I've been, I've been out that shit too, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That's probably why she didn't have her camera on in the first place. Your mama let you date? What? Your mama let you date? What? Your mama let you date? Yeah. You want a girlfriend? Huh? You want a girlfriend? No. Why not? I'm straight. I can't be your girlfriend? No, I'll holla at you. Alright, bye. <laughs> honestly, she was probably ugly. I ain't gonna lie. She sound like she sound like she was older or some shit. But honestly, if a girl is like this super direct, you definitely gonna think it's a joke. Hot girls usually don't be doing that shit because they know that the guys will come to them. But it's usually the more less attractive girls will just be straightforward like that. Like at least at least warm my guy up or some shit. You know what I'm saying? At least ask for his number or a Snapchat or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, want a girlfriend? No, you ugly ass bitch. I want a girlfriend. <laughs> what is your body count? Five. What are the chances of me making that six tonight? <laughs> Zero. I'm a roommate. Zero. Hey, let her talk. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know. We can find yeah, out though. She, she's 
blushing. Chances are good. Wait, I got lip gloss on you. Oh, you fine. Let me get your number. Okay. Violation. Yeah, she clearly likes my guy, but that one friend, bro, it's always that one friend that be cock blocking, bro. I can't tell you how many times I've dealt with that shit when I be talking to girls, bro. The, the, the girl will be interested in me, right? And then the friend just comes and pull up, pulls her away or just says some bullshit, bro. Like, it's always these cock blocking friends, bro. They be blocking relationships for their girls. Their girls, that could be her future husband right there. She out here cock blocking. These girls need to just settle down, bro. They need to stop being so bitter and stop blocking their friends' blessings, bro. Shit, baby, I'm talking to you. I'm, this, this is a blessing right here. You know what I'm saying, my baby? This is a blessing. Damn, don't let your friend block your blessings. Shit! I just want to be a brain shatter. Huh? Huh? Indeed. Like... She way too old to be talking waiting till marriage. Like the fuck, who's gonna wait till marriage for you? You probably been ran through already. Like she's talking about like she's an 18 year old virgin. Like at your age, if you tell that to any guy, they're not gonna take you serious. They really ain't gonna take you serious. They ain't got, they ain't got time to wait. Niggas, niggas old. You old. What time do you have? Shit. Do you wanna have sex with me? Honey, you are okay or you have any? Get out of here. Come on. Okay. Get out of here. You gonna be yeah. in jail for these funny things, you know? I'm gonna call the police now. We gotta call it, you guys. Approach the guy. You asked him if you wanna have sex with you? I like to see what you got yeah. in your camera. Yeah, yeah. Talk to my partner real yeah. Okay? This is a big offense, you know? This is no China or whatever you're from. What she offered to me is a big offense. You can go to jail for be funny. Yo, this man really called the police on her. <laughs> this man was not playing no games, bro. He was not playing no games. See, that's why if a girl is so direct, it's like, it's like, yeah, you could either be getting set up or she's a hooker, a prostitute, you know what I'm saying? So, shit. Ladies really got no game, man. They really got no game. Her breath probably stank. No, I don't want to talk. I'm going to go. Can you get away from my car, please? I just cannot just sit down. Can you get away from my car? I don't even want to talk. I'm rolling up the window. I'm going to go. I don't even want to talk. Hey, your braid stuck in the window. Move so I can pull off. This man rolled the window up with her braid stuck in there, bro. He, he really wanted to get away from her. What did she do, man? What she do? Let me know. What she do? She must have been horrible. She must have did something horrible. If you're gonna shoot your shot, you don't have a camera in my guy's face, man. At least try that shit off camera first. It's like if you got a crush on somebody and you wanna ask them on a date, you gotta pull your phone out first. I've been liking you for a while now. Like, would you go on a date with me? And like, you, you gotta record that shit? Come on now. Yeah, you gotta kiss me. <laughs> Alright, that, that was kinda funny. You, you knew damn well he did not wanna kiss that girl, bruh. But it's funny that she was actually reaching out to kiss him, though. That reminds me of when this old lady was trying to hit on me in one of my videos. I'm saving myself for marriage. You are? Yeah. Do you have a girlfriend? I do not. Why? Because I, I don't want a girlfriend right now. I'm focusing on my career right How now. Old you? I'm 19. Hey. Yeah, I, I didn't want none of that, bruh. I didn't want no parts of that. I was trying to get away. <laughs> I be doing that sometimes too. You know, some of these girls be leaving me on red. Whenever these girls be texting back, I leave them on red too. I say, how that shit taste? Huh? How, how does it taste? Yeah, how, how you feel? I was in a situation like this, y'all. I was, I was at a club. And then this girl came up to me, told me I'm cute and told me that she wanted to kiss me. And what I do, I kissed her, y'all. I, I, I folded, man. I did, I, did, I did end up kissing her. But would I do it again? <laughs> I probably will if I'm gonna be honest, bro. Hi, how's it going? Good, You're quite you? tall. How tall are they? <laughs> oh, what size? I'm not sure, I'm like five foot 10. <sighs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to say no, I'm sorry. How are you doing? Good, Zara, how are you? Very good. Ugh. I'm about to say no, I'm sorry. How you doing? I'm good, how are you? I'm chill, I'm very chill. How are you doing? Um, yeah. You've already asked me that. <laughs> <laughs> You're nervous. Be, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Uh, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> so I'm guessing he don't like blondes, because they've been three blondes in a row so far, he rejected all of them. So 
I'm Yasmin, I'm 29. Oh, okay. <sighs> I'm gonna have to say no, sorry. What are you doing? I'm 24, a fire performer. A fire performer? I am. Okay. Oh. Stop doing I'm that! No, sorry. Oh my God. Oh. Yeah, bro, this nigga probably just don't like girls, bro. <laughs> I'm Louise, I'm from Germany. Okay. It's nice to meet you, how are you? I'm good. Uh, you look like you fuck me. <laughs> hey, yo, I'm about to say no. <laughs> oh. I won't be surprised if she was a tranny, bro. I would not be surprised if she was a tranny, but if she is not, I'd sincerely apologize. But she looked like it, though. I ain't gonna lie, man. The way she came in, how big she was, she definitely looked like she'd be fucking niggas. There's a UPS guy that comes to my work every day. He comes every day to deliver shit, okay? Every day, okay? And when he comes in, he flirts with me. He flirts. He's a flirt. We have a thing. We flirt. I don't pay him no money. Okay, <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. I don't pay him no mind. Because I'm not in the market. I'm single, but I'm not in the market. Okay, but I have come to expect when this UPS guy comes in, I'm going to get flirted with. Okay, it's part of my routine at this point in my life. Today, that little bastard came in, and I was ready. I was, I was ready for my little wink, for my little... I was ready, and I looked at him to receive and he goes like this and he walks out don't she realize like they are not actually a thing she's probably just being nice here and there probably just flirting like a little bit here and there it's not serious but she just came on tiktok and does all this for something that's not even that serious she crazy i, I could tell she's probably crazy bro I can tell she's probably crazy. She give me that vibe, man. She give me that vibe. Female insect that knew that men aren't and knew to rip their heads off after mating with them. An insect. See what I told y'all? She crazy. She crazy, bro. She crazy, man. So we can just like girls can talk about men like this, bro. Talking about ripping their heads off and killing all men and doing all this shit. But if a guy ever says anything like that, bro, it's, it's done. It's a done deal. It's a done deal. Women all over social media saying men need to die or something. You know what I'm saying? This shit crazy out here. But she clearly got some issues. She can't handle a simple little rejection. And the guy didn't even reject her like that. He just said peace out. You know what I'm saying? He just didn't flirt that one day. And she's going crazy. She's going crazy, retarded, stupid on social media. And with that said, I'll see you on the next video, man. Woo!